Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to get videos from YouTube for processing inside of Bitscribe. That's very easy. Start by going to campaigns and creating a new campaign. We are going to start from scratch. Let's just call it test three. Yep, let's be imaginative. Click on submit. You've got a new campaign. Click on it and you've got a button that says upload a file. Click on that. And here you will see uh, op an option that says YouTube URL. Click on that. And if you've got a YouTube URL, you can always paste it. Otherwise, you can get it from YouTube. I'm going to show you how. Now, before we go ahead, I do want to tell you always go for videos that you know you have permission for. Videos are often copyright protected and you will not be allowed to do this. You'll not be allowed to download and post them anywhere or convert them unless you have permission. So just make sure you do have permission and getting the URL is very easy. Click on it. Hey, copy Janice. it from the address bar. That's it. So I've got this URL from here. Copy it paste it into your into your Bitscribe and then click on submit. Uh, sorry, click on download first and let's call it test three. Click on save. And OK, I just quickly got into my code because I was testing. But for you, it will be transparent. And you will see this little box which says, please wait while we download the video. And depending on how big the video is, it can take a minute or so. And when the video is fully downloaded, you will notice that this box goes away. And inside of your file explorer, you can test the file. You can see the file that we just got. So we downloaded a file called test three. And inside of Windows Explorer, we can see we got the file called test three. It's right over here. So that's how easy it is to download a YouTube video using Bitscribe and then you can just go for file upload, browse it and just put that video in, select the language and start processing. So I hope you can do this easily now yourself. Just a tip, if ever the downloader stops working, you need to probably update the YouTube downloader. For this, we use a tool called YouTube DL, which is a very popular tool uh, and uh, it's a freeware. It's a open source product, you can find it online. And Bitscribe automatically gets YouTube DL when you first sign in. So if the version has changed, if something has changed on YouTube, YouTube DL is usually updated. And you might need to update it on Bitscribe too. To do that, just go to App Data, type App Data in your Windows Explorer, then go to Technic Force, find Bitscribe AI or Bitscribe AI Pro as the case may be. And you will see this file, youtube.dl.exe, just delete it. Because what will happen is when Bitscribe is run the next time, it's going to download the latest version again. So this is how you can always make sure that the downloader is the latest version, YouTube DL is the latest version, and your Bitscribe will work as designed.